Content over everything. Hold on, hold on, before we go to Haiti. Before we go to Haiti, let's go back to Africa. It was amazing. You see, you see, you see what is happening here is you have a very limited uh, historical reading. Guys, you almost cameras coming. You don't know about African. No, do you know about African? No, I don't mean, I'm asking you. No, 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 but you made it for me. Captain is wrong. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, he doesn't care. That's what I want to say. Here's what I think. You made it. Guys, you made it. This doesn't change anything. I know, I agree with that. But what I'm saying, he's trying to say that in Africa. I'm not his ex. I'm only a We know you're demonstrating that every time. What can you make a statement like that? <laughs> because no, hold on. He says it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You said it does not matter. Innit? It doesn't change your point. Yeah. Here's what, where, where you you comes, just said. You just said it does not change your point anyway. But because you never had that additional information, yes. your point came out wrong. So it does make it, it matters. Because then you're you, going into delusion you now that exactly. you know that. You even have said that. Like, I, I, you, you I respect that. you as a race realist, right? As someone who wants to maintain your tribe and people are Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. Here's the issue. When you talk about other people's cultures yeah, yeah, and you get it wrong, you're doing us a disservice, isn't it? Yeah. I'm not so we understand that. So next I know, I'm West Virginia. So, we, so when Europe was in the Dark Ages, that's when Africa's empire was booming. Right? That, just go Google the Mali Empires. Right? Let's yeah. Google. You're not yeah. aware of So if, if you don't accept Egypt as, as, as a black African uh, uh, empire, go look at the, the empire of Kush, which is right next door. You see the needs. You can't get any blacker than that. The so, Sultanates yeah. in Somalia. Yeah. The, 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 the empires in South Africa. You, you said in South Africa. Okay. Any, let's talk about Haiti. Let's talk about Haiti. It's good, good point. Talk yeah. about Haiti. Go ahead. Well, the African, well, we had Haiti, which is a French colony. Yeah. It was a very prosperous country, booming trade, very yes. wealthy. People lived there. People lived there in, you know, they lived there well, good standard of living. Then the, the Africans there slaughtered all the whites, including the babies. I'm glad, I'm gl I'm glad he said this. Now, yeah. I'm so glad he said this. Well, like, 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 he just oh. wants it. Like, I can't go. So, and my point is, look, look at what is going on. Here's this unpacking, right? So you had slave people who didn't want to be enslaved. I understand. I understand. Perhaps it was justified. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Justified. Now, what happened is, the end result, let me speak. Look at the society oh. which they have created. Yeah, yeah, so let's, I, go. let's go there. there. Let's go there. there. Let's go there. That's so why reading the, is important. So you, 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 you had the, the Spanish, the French, and the English who came together to keep them enslaved after they rebelled, right? All of them lost. You, you, you said that, what have they done? But then Haiti's actually made, made a, a castle in Haiti to yeah. defend them from the invasion. But, well, what I'm saying is, go on Wikipedia, just type it in, it's there, right? Everyone no. can get their phone. Oh, okay, well, okay, all right. So it's, it's still there now, right? You, you've seen, you, listen, we're trying to give you game. We're trying to give you noise that you don't have, right? So what I'm saying is, that's what happened here. Now, what happened is when Haiti actually won the actual war, right? They were actually giving, they were actually sending out uh, soldiers to assist other enslaved uh, people. But what happened is all the European nations did what you did, right? They got on cold and they started placing sanctions on on Haiti, saying because you destroyed. So it's the, like they deal with Putin yeah, nowadays. Yeah, that's exactly yeah, what happened to That's because you you destroyed the enslavement um, tools. Yeah. So we're going to put sanctions. We're not going to trade. We're not going to treat you like a nation. And that's when you see Haiti going. Go, uh, facing hardship. Now, I, 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 give, I give you people's credit, right? Because of the dominance of white supremacy and racism, yeah. even though they lost and, and their three best armies lost, they realized that the best way is to actually just use all the connections that they've got and, yeah. and, and, and put sanctions yes. on, on the people. And that's so, why. So, that's why. Yeah, not because that, that's they're not capable because, of Not because they're capable. Like I said, you just that's said. That's not true. How oh? much foreign aid have we given to Haiti? Okay, oh, oh, okay. You jump too quick. You jump too quick. You jump too quick. You jump too quick. Now, 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 if you study like. Please, please, can I just jump from jump? And other things you forgot to say, uh, we talked about reparation, weren't we? Oh, okay, sure. Did you not know that Haiti had to pay reparation to France until yeah. recently? Hold on, hold on, because you don't know this. Yeah. France, uh, Haiti paid reparation to France because France lost Haiti and had to sell ha uh, had to sell land in Middle America to Spain. So they had to recoup that money. And, 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 and they made Haiti pay reparations. Google, if you want to Google right now, you can Google that's, it. Yeah, that, that's fact, everyone right, so knows. That's a fact, that's, that's, a, that's, a, that's, a, that's a fact. That's so, a fact. Right, so once Haiti had gotten independence, yeah. what society did they create? It doesn't matter. Bro, what? if the yeah. world powers are ganging up on you, like they're trying to gang up on Putin no, right now. All right, what? here's another thing. Look at the, the island that Haiti is on. There's yeah. the Dominican Republic and Haiti. Yeah. And there's a I, line Haiti's quite, quite isolated, if you look geographically speaking. They're, they're very close together and there's a line between the two. It's the same island, okay. yet there's What's different societies. They and did, the they, different people have created face, the different They didn't face the same sanctions. They never faced the same sanctions. What sanctions? It's like me the stealing your Americans have gone into Haiti, given them millions, built the infrastructure there, built, given them millions in reparations. They've taken resources out of Haiti. I mean, have you seen any documentary on Haiti? Have you seen any kind of anything? I have seen 
what, not really. Exactly. And, yeah. and this is my point. Everything, listen, as a race really, someone whose heart's this way, no matter what we tell you, right, you're going to say, really? I've already told this castle. None, of, none of this even, it's all besides the point to me anyway. Well, but here's what it is. You can't, listen, you're making ignorant statements. When we correct yeah. you down, I don't care. Yeah, yeah. If you yeah, don't care, yeah. you don't care. This but, is but, my opinion. Listen, what I, I see. Be, right? I'm saying this, be a race really, but li li don't be ignorant on yes, cultures you're yes, talking please. about. I'm sorry. Love Europeans, love, Read love books. your tribe, whatever it is. But don't talk about Mali or Haiti or Egypt and, and, and be ignorant. It's just. Yeah, and and yeah, simplify the situation. What are you doing? You're simplifying it. It's, it's way more complex that human history is very complex. Do you understand? Agree, yeah. And 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 I, I that's what that's what I was asking the brothers. Here. I was like, anything you're saying, I want for my people. I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. I want my people to prosper. Yes, but that but but that doesn't mean the reason why I want my people to prosper is is, is historical. It's historical. I don't even think that. Because Basically, you know, I'm you know from how there's, there's this yeah. this theory of like Africa just think that you know, well maybe it's true, but they have this glorious civilization in Egypt. And no, that's like, not only that's ignorance as well. I know, it's but not like, only Egypt. people believe that, right? Well, Egyptology the, or something. No, people, people on my side generally they debunk it, make fun of it, but it's like it may or may not be true. But well, oh, 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 here's a point. Well, the right? thing is, they've got the DNA from the pharaohs. They've got the DNA from the pharaohs, right? But the thing is, I suspect. If you're not on Stormfront, you should get on there because his, are you on Stormfront? My point. Are you is, on Stormfront? No. Okay, we should get there because even Stormfront is the number one right, white supremacist. Here's my point. As you know, hold on. Can I finish my point? The, yeah. the, okay. Well, you just made. What are you doing? You're saying things, that, and, and you're going. What I'm saying is, I noticed that there's a contingent of black people yeah. that are uh, very into Egypt, yes. the history of Egypt, and yeah. that may or may not be true. That's a particular group of black but, people. But you need to know why. You need to know why. Uh, if, if they want to yeah. have that as a basis, you believe that they were great, and if they want to use that as a basis for them to grow as a people and prosper like I don't really have, feel like I want to take that away from them like yeah. if they want to mm -hmm. go into a land and have that as their mythological basis of, to survive and prosper then mm. but like it's similar when you say yeah. oh you must feel guilty about all your history it's, it's like I, I, I don't I've, necessarily I've, think I've, I've, let's you know I've never said you as a European is going to feel guilty so like, it's I've like what you're said. saying may or may not be true but the result of it is very negative hey? on my people so it's like well, well, why would you want what's negative on your people what's negative? I don't know basically forcing what is you're saying why should we pay reparations then okay so you're saying that you want people to leave and I'm saying the best way to get people to leave is to pay for the damages you've done which is yeah, I'm not even opposed to it so what, I'm, so what I'm saying until you do that everyone here is going to go oh, we're cool we're That's right. to but you understand well, you're a race realist right so you're putting Europeans first right and you understand that because you conquered the fair square it's yours yeah, that, yeah, that's what you're saying, right? So, as people who are conquered, we're saying that if every other nation has received reparations and you want us out, pay reparations. Mm. Well, what would that involve? Well, that, well, well, More than a passport. <laughs> yeah, it will involve a, lot, it'll a whole lot of um, gold, jewels, resources, land. Well, maybe, maybe some of I don't know. I'm that's going to bankrupt uh, Europe, by the way. But, it yeah. would bankrupt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. it would be a very difficult. Cool. Cool. There would be no Europe. Start you know, the French president, uh, What's his name again? I like Macron. Macron. Before. No, uh, no, Macron. Uh, Macron. No, before that. Um, Sarkozy. No, you look at Oyan. Hollande. Jacques Chirac. Oh, that guy, yeah. I never said that. No, no, no. What he's saying is, uh, he, he's a race realist. Do you think even black people would accept that? Because most black people like living in, you know, wet European Western countries. They like, some they like buying shoes, some like do. having a smartphone. <laughs> Why are you not going to convince them to go to Africa? <laughs> it's, it's just not going to happen. Well, uh, are you going to convince the, the, Afri the Europeans in Africa to come home? Probably not. Yeah, how are you going to make it? I'm not trying to convince them. That's so all I'm saying. It's a different thing, isn't it? Like, well, I don't think you're ever going to convince but them. The fact, oh, the fact is that you'll see that black, you got, black people prefer to live in How many states. got to put you? Yeah. Well, yeah, everyone's some. Why is that? Yeah. Why is that? Yeah. Some is more realistic. Well, here's the thing. Yeah. People are flooding into Western countries. They're not going the other way. So there's only one thing you can get from that. Why is it all? Because this is a bit... You can only assume that this is a better country. Why is it a better? Why is it a better? Well, I'd say it's mostly the unspoken sort of social contracts where you can expect people to be polite. You go and have a Struggle. Oh, no, it's it's evolution. 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 A lot of so, 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 so,
that you force people to say something and it's because of cotton growing, well, the economy grew so big and cheap growing. Is that true? Is that true? But me, I don't talk to you. Is it against slavery? How did America... Slavery, slavery is a very inefficient way of, of, of deriving labor. You know? I mean, it, it actually helped... Look at the South. The South is the poorest part of America. The North had no slaves. Slavery held back industrialization. Industrialization is a much a more efficient way of transferring you, you labor. America to the beautiful country you point. Because it was in Muhammad. Yeah. Well, come on, man. It was not. Listen, only like 1% of Americans had slaves at the height of slavery. Huh? Okay, who do do the hard work to build right, it? Listen, there aren't the cotton buildings on me. You're not answering my question. It wasn't. The, 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 the trains, yes. The roads and the Sweden. Sweden. All right, look at Sweden. It never had slaves. Look, Sweden is a similar to Britain. It's, it's not about. I'm asking you a question. Right. America, yes. Is the camera for window? Yeah. 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 I understand it had slavery, okay, but so that's not I'm what made it what it is today. The country that has a strong infrastructure. Go, Yakiri. Um, I'm saying to you, the infrastructure in America, who built it, was it white people? Yes. Yeah. 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 It's like giving yeah. credit to your hand. Look at his hands. Look at his hands. Look at his hands. The people that did the hard work to build the railway roads. Do you, I understand. Do you give credit to a hammer for building a house? Who are you talking about? For your, who, who designed it? You give credit to the man who used the hammer. So, so, if exactly. You just, if you've got just an idea in your head with no one to build it, is it ever going to get built? You're buying too much coin there. What? If you have an idea of a beautiful country, but it's just an idea in your head and no one does the hard work, is it going to get built? But you know what? You know, the reality of history is what it's in the middle of both of you. It was not yeah. just a slave, and it was not. It was a collective uh, thing. The North had no slaves. But, the world they had. But you, but you agree. You agree. It was a collective thing. Indians, it was not just a. You, you agree that Indian America in it are in the situation of the world they are today. It's because they work on the whole world to the resources. Do you agree with that? Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. Did England make a success of its own country and its own work? No, not because of that. Okay, cause, so because it conquered the whole of the world, yes? Yeah. And stole and pillaged other countries, that's how it got so, so successful. Doesn't that prove that it was more advanced, that it was able to do that? Was Doesn't it prove? No, it's 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 no that's human nature. Look. When two different tribes come into contact with, two different African tribes come into contact with each other, they war. Hold on. So oh, that's just human nature. Oh, so, so, so you're saying that it's good to rather well, still have a No, what I'm saying is it's naive to think that it won't happen. I'm not asking you if it's going to happen. The, the, the thing is, brother, here's what it is. We're speaking to him before you come. He's a race realist. So as a race realist, well, as a race realist, he won't care about the ethical things you're saying. His thing is, he's from a European tribe and he wants what's best for them. So, so, if, someone, so if someone came and stole your phone now, would you report it to the police? What's your point? You know what, my what about, would you say the same about the Osman Empire? Yeah, I believe someone stole someone's land by full shifts, I believe it's not. Well, you know, it's like when two different ant colonies come into contact yeah. with each other, one takes over the other and kills it, and then the ant species gets stronger as a whole. So this is, this is nature, this is the way nature works. That, that, that's the way the nature, no, you're you used to it. That's your nature. You can deny you human know, nature. You know ethnic like, people are not going nowhere in reality, you know that. You sure, know this yeah. idea you have in your head? I don't have any idea. No. Like, well, you're, you're you're, okay, it. I'm trying to say, this well, you idea that's, that you that's have... That's what I was asking you earlier on. This idea that you have what in your head that white people will just live in one place on their own. No, but no, no it's for sure. You, you want your people to prosper. Yes, well, that's fine. Maybe. I want my people to prosper. That is a fair thing. But I'm not going to hurt your tribe and destroy your tribe. I'm going to let you go on and I'm going to let myself go on. He believes in his privilege, white privilege. I don't, I don't, that, that we have to subjugate all the nations. No, 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 he does, no, 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 he benefits no, from my privilege. He's yeah. not going to give it back. Bro, Where's that's that my privilege. Be? He doesn't think somewhere in your peace, my peace. No, he, yeah, he actually thinks that black people could be banned from it. They would have their own homeland. They could have their own homeland. And they could be banned from going to that area. They would have their own community. I never asked you if they could have their own community. Because what I'm doing is I'm looking from his perspective. I'm asking you, are you looking to have are you looking no, to have a, much are much you looking to have a land that I, black I, I, people? I don't understand because I know this is history. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. People yeah. conquer people. other people. So, Bro, show me one nation that hasn't done it. Wait, this is his time. Yeah. He's the best. Now, know. you know, you know what the predicament is for us black people. There's more conflict. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know the predicament here is 
to suit that unfortunately we live in a generation where we are the No, I don't believe places I don't believe places that are white black unfortunately. That, that is the yeah, only thing, that's the only reality. There's a privilege that this young woman has okay. historically. So that you want to create a place that only yes, white people can live. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, so can we get can we get all the can we get sorry, sorry bro. Let's get one voice, sorry. So the the thing is you've come a bit late, but he's a race realist. So uh, you he, he is a, a tribe first, meaning he's European. So anyone from, say, uh, England all the way to, say, Poland, and before you hit Turkey, that kind of area, like the, the, the white, white, right? Yeah. What, historical white. And what he's saying is, everywhere, anywhere you find white people, whether it's South Africa, Canada, America, they've conquered the land fair and square. So, am I wrong? No, I just think that. And I'm not saying it's right or wrong. All groups of people. Here's why Remember, I believe. Nothing right? I'm saying. I'm not saying that what you're saying is right or wrong. I'm just trying because th what's going to happen is. That's not why you know I believe. I believe that all people okay. have a right to advocate in their own interests. And like you advocate for your own interests, yeah. you advocate for your own interests, and I advocate for my own interests. Yes, but then. But, I don't but, want my yeah, children to grow up as a minority. Listen, I just I don't want my children to grow up as a minority in their own their own school, their own city. Well, hold, before we get there, all this comes from fear, right? Hold on, friend of mine. So what? What, what is the fear of you becoming a minority in your school? What is your fear? It's not just fear. Earlier when we had a conversation, it's not the ideal situation to be in. Is it? Oh, I know he's a race really, so I really know that. I really know that. But what I'm saying is. Do you think it's good to be a minority in, in your country? In, in your, well, it's like this. In your own country. Oh, hold on. Here's what it is, right? It, it's it, not an it, ideal it, to be in. It's not an ideal. If you're being be mistreated, in, you could be. It doesn't matter what you are, right? It just so happens that. But, well, South Africans uh, have been that. They've been treated. Yeah. They've been treated as a minority in their own country, and then you what? were just saying. Yeah. Like, he's just saying that uh, he, he didn't want the white people to get kicked out. He and said. Well, he, he, then like I suspect. I wouldn't mind if they. No, I wouldn't mind if they came back to Europe. So I suspect you feel that if you're a minority, you'll be mistreated. Am I wrong or am I correct? Well, all minorities are mistreated to an extent. Right. So here's what it is, right? So then you, you feel that supremacy. how how your ancestors yeah, no, treated other people. Nature. This is naivety. Are you listening? When you have a, a group. Do you feel that how your ancestors treated minorities, those minorities were treated the same? Is that is that a fear? No. So, I, so what is the fear? Then, if that is the case. I just don't want my children to be a minority in their own, their own city. In America, they're going to be a minority anyway. Say a couple of decades. In Europe, and but who's a pure white person anyway? But the America yeah, was the thing. Black you know what a white person is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, he's right? correct, right? Let's not trick. Listen, he, he, as a race realist, we know what European white people are. We know. Yeah. A Polish, Polish, we know. A Polish right? Yes. yes, they accept it. He's a, a racist. People. No, no. Not a, he's a race realist. So. Turkish come from Central Asia, Slavic are from the Balkan, and he's Germanic. Wait, listen, so, a ra yeah. race realism is, is ra people. race realism is white supremacy renamed. So once you understand what white supremacy is, then you understand where it's coming from. But the white people come from black people anyway. No, but that, that's the, the, as a race realist, man, speak, you can speak, you can jump in. But yeah. as a race realist, white people come they, from black they'll people ignore that. He'll ignore What's that. What's your point? He'll ignore so, you can, so what? We're, so what? Just say this. So what? White people don't exist. No, no, no. I never, who said white people really? don't exist? You're speaking to me, are you? Well, you just <laughs> said something which no, has I said no to white, relevance to anything. No, it does. You, white people come from black people. Yes. Well, that's actually kind of disputed. But how's it disputed? Hold on, hold on, hold on. But there's been. Like skeletons found, like in Europe, it's that, not, that aren't from Africa. Uh, uh, but yeah, but are they are they, are they over two hundred thousand years? Uh, I'm not sure, but it doesn't really no, but, make but, a difference. Well, it it difference. difference. You, you, you haven't that, you yeah, haven't studied people, these arguments. Sure, people. Right, let's say people came out of Africa. They evolved for th tens of thousands of years yes. in specific locations, yes. specific environments, yes. and that's what shaped them. Yes. And so that's where it is. We're not all. So you can say. But we you still care about people. That doesn't make so, any difference. Huh? That doesn't make any difference. It does because you're originating you originate for black people. So it's trying to find this pure white thing. I'm not trying to find this more, pure uh, this white. More advanced uh, race. Just, oh, the more, I have my own people. Yeah. I like my own people. Um, just so because we're going to go over the same points. But most race yeah. realists, they, they, uh, am I wrong? They, they look at like a 60,000 year history do, kind do of people. Do, not you, 200, do, do, you, do you believe that your peer, peer, your peer people have better uh, morals than black people? No, not necessarily. I just definitely. so if I have the same morals as you, why can't we get along and live in the same place? Well, because I've listened to a lot of these people like Richard Spencer and stuff. So I, I know they don't believe this. Do you watch John Claude? Do you watch John Claude? Um, well, you know who John Claude is on YouTube, don't you? No. You don't know who he is. You I know no Richard idea. Spencer, though, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so you don't. You haven't heard Richard Spencer. You know Richard Richard Spencer, yeah. Yeah. Is he someone you take knowledge from? I guess so, yeah. Yeah, well, he talks about that when you see white people, 
there's a certain kind of culture and ethics they have. Do you agree with that? Yeah. So and he says when you look at black people, they have well, different people create different societies in their own image. I've, I've listened and to a lot of Twitter, but he says that black people there's a lot of crime in the, when you look into communities. Yeah. So let's let's get to the truth of it. Do you believe that white people are morally up, more upright? It's than not black that people? I think they're superior. It's just that they're my own people. So I, I like. I prefer my own people. That's not what Richard Spencer says. Well, he says he wants to go. Spencer, he, wants, he wants an ethno state, yeah. I don't because... necessarily agree with, with that either. Okay. So 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 basically, you want a place with. Right, just... It seems to me that you you're a Muslim, right? Yeah. You you want to further. You want your people to prevail. You want to stick up for their interests, right? Yeah, but the I'm... but the thing is this, yeah. I don't think yeah you're lesser than me because you're white. I, neither do I. Just... No, no. I, I, I find it hard to believe. Yes, I find it hard to believe, especially growing up in London, yeah, that. If we have the same morals, yeah, and we all work and we all look after our families and this that and the other, that you want to be alone, that you want to be alone, yeah, just for the sake of, because of the skin colour, yes? So it's like... Well, that's very naive though, because that's never, people are different. You know, no, what I'm saying, you said you want to play... You're never going to change that. You want a place where just the white people are in America, yes? Yeah. So what is it? Is it the white tone that you like and you dislike the black tone? I like the... What do I like yeah. about yeah. what? Elaborate. Well, the fact that they're, they're my own people. You know, I don't want them to be driven to a minority, which is what's happening in America. But the world is... The also, in general, but in general, you, it's about birth rates as well. Mm, See, for any mm, society to replace it's itself... Excessive. For any society to replace itself... It needs but the reality, in the children. world, there's going to be more ethnic people, the yes? Is, this is be... the problem, exactly. We need to preserve... You know, we need to start working work. towards our own interests. You know why it's it not going to work? Even Muslims alone, yeah? So what are you saying? We should just... Uh, just I'm, just, I'm just saying, you can look at it as a race as a dying out. And right, so let's say, so you're saying right now that if we just keep it the way it is, it's not going to work. No, but I, if we I, do I'm create a homeland, you, then it may work. I'm saying so to you, the fact shouldn't? of the matter is, yeah, the fact of the matter is, yeah, is that people are going to interbreed and this, and this white no, race is going to... That's not gonna, true. People huh? naturally prefer their own kind. People prefer people I'm not, I'm not the saying they don't, DNA but I'm just themselves. saying over time that, the, that this pure white race is, is going to mix with other races. That's, that's the reality. How can you say that? Because what if, because people are having relationships with everyone else. Well, history will take its course. Only two percent of like marriages are into race, so you can't say. Who says who? Not amongst the Muslim community. What are you statistics. talking about? Well, of the. Look, no, I'm saying to you, it's just a fact, yeah. That I understand. By time, by time, yeah, unfortunately, this is the problem. And I, and I, and I, what I'm saying is, I'm this not, is I don't have drained this, but I'm just saying by time that this is. Ex that, I agree that, with you. That, that, this is why. Change. This is exactly why I'm doing what Careful. I'm doing. I'm sorry. Thank you. Like the fact you said that and you agree with that is exactly why. So I you, think you you adhere to the replacement theory that there is a replacement happening. Oh yeah. What's exactly. that? Free, what's free called again? That the well, it's not really a theory. It's just the well, it's the Europeans are becoming. A what's, the, what's the word? There's a word that you it's put. Replacement. It's called it's replacement. replacement theory. Theory. Is that, is that it was uh, Lauren. You know, like Lauren Southern. Yeah, I watched yeah, the video on yeah, that. Yeah. She took, and it's about birth rate as well. It's about birth rate in in Europe. I don't like her. Though. Yeah, no, but anyway, it's the birth rate in Europe right now, it's it's crazy. Yeah, one point. Europeans are not making babies and by hundred or two hundred years you will be yeah. outnumbered yeah. Exactly. In, in some places and that's that's what you don't but that's want life. No. exactly no, that's but not life it's not life i understand this that bro you yeah. want to be to no, but i'm trying to say to you what can i do if i was yeah. about if i was white yeah. i'm not going to spend all day like thinking that as time goes on white people are going to tie out but you're not white he is yeah, yeah. you've got and to that's think his right. here's the yeah. thing though okay we've but, got but, to think but about the future he's not like your average white he's like he's a historical white so he's thinking how many white people fought many many years ago and, that, and that's where no, he's at not really. But, just, I'm, but are you not? People think like okay. five years. But you're, 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 I'm you're thinking five hundred. But you're gonna go in the next twenty years. Where do you? Where is it that you? You wanna go anyway? Well, you're well, to be how do you know there's, there's not gonna be white people are not gonna be? Why do you care about that? Exactly. White people in majority. Because humans well, always care, bro. Well, that's what he. he but that's always, I understand. It. But, but he does. You not? But humans collectively always cared about what's gonna happen with our humanity. But look at the problem. But look at the problem. Where are you from? Well. London, down the road, kill me. <laughs> okay, <laughs> fine. But I'm, I'm Don't from Congo, innit? I'm from Congo, innit? And my, like, people in my nation, yeah, care about what happened to them in 100 years. Maybe That's why people build. Okay. That's, what That's why people leave behind. Like That's why we leave behind a yeah, Islamic concept. It's true, concept. it's true. But, it's true. It's true. but what's the solution? Should we castrate ourselves? Huh? No, you should, should no, we just, what they have to should, what the Europeans have to start doing is you have to start exactly, loving each other exactly, yourself. That's exactly what but the, the problem that you are facing right now is that there are a lot of people who conflate that 
with nationalism and racism and all these systems who have failed in the past. That's why we have populism in Europe right now and that you kind of cling into it. It's just a fade. Do and you know what? There's another like, problem as like, well. I'm, as a convert to Islam. And God. That's not God. Yeah, and, 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 and there's another problem, problem as well. I know a lot of Muslims in their early 20s, yeah, who are getting married, yeah? And the average Muslim family will say, hey, like, people get married, married young, mm. and I have, like, Muslim families, like, 21, 19, it's not strange to see Muslim couples married, yeah? Exactly. yeah. And having yeah. kids, yeah? That's like, what I say. And I... having kids, yeah? And raising, uh, trying to raise a more structural thing. A lot of, a lot of people, not, not just um, white, sorry, not just white people, mm. are not getting married. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. They're I, just having girlfriends, yeah. So. I actually admire sort of Islam in a way because Thank if you, you look much. at them like their women they don't go out and like take drugs like mm. they have a lot of children and they stay at home and mm. like they have they're a, they've got strong they can work, convictions. By the way. Mm. yeah but, like they're a cohesive group like, yeah they they work for their own interests they grow rapidly it's like whilst I don't want it in the country like, <laughs> I'm, we could we, listen cut, this, cut this out we, cut. We, we, we need to start acting cut. like that ourselves so if we start yeah, acting yeah but the thing so, is is that when you've got YOLO and all this stuff it's not gonna happen <laughs> You know? Yeah, it's the philosophy. Because, it's because so. you know what? A lot of guys, they, listen, a lot of guys, like this. and they have we, a few girls' numbers in their exactly, phone, yeah? And if they get pregnant, they're just like, that chip goes in, you don't have the Thames in your country, but that chip goes in a river. Exactly. Because sorry, the number you're calling is currently on a river. adopting like the same moral conviction. Yeah, but you can't have your cake Islam. and eat it. You can't expect your race. You can't not be a father to your kids and stay ha and have kids with a, uh, a woman and marry her and stuff. No, what and I'm and still, is, if we were are you doing your part? Yeah, yeah. So are you married? Well, I'm, I'm actually 16, so I'm still in school. So. Okay, well, he's much older than 16. Yeah, I thought you were like... What about, what about, <laughs> you just said something amazing. You said you admire certain... Um, I admire, like, the... Certain characteristics that Muslims have yeah. that, that causes cohesion, right? And uh, uh, it furthers civilization, right? It furthers their own people. Yeah, well, civilization, right? Because I'm talking from a human... Like these people throw people yeah. off buildings and stuff. Anyway, they've got you're, strong you're, moral conviction. No, but okay, we're talking yeah, about UK right now. No one throws anyone. On UK, no one throws anyone. You know, <laughs> you go to Brixton, you won't see that. You find a mafia throwing people off before you right. find Muslims throwing people because they're gay. Do you understand? What I'm trying to say to you is, yeah, you, you, you clearly see there's something. Oh, you know, I admire these people. Why don't you try it out? That's what I'm doing. That's what. No, what I'm become Muslim. I'm not going to be Muslim. No. Why? Different. Clearly, I said things you like about. But the thing is this, yeah. Come, come I, I don't see all these white guys, yeah. Most white young guys, yeah, and even black guys in this country live a secular life. And that part is obviously like making money, working, and stuff like that, and mm. having one night stands and stuff like this. So yeah. it, it seems you're concerned about the white race dying out, but you're not putting in the work to change it. Yes, well. Do you understand what I'm saying? Who says I'm not bringing the work? So uh, okay. I'm here and speaking about it. You've had a girlfriend before, haven't you? What's your point? Yeah. Okay. So, okay. But the point I'm trying to say is that you can't be angry that Muslims, because generally, I would say that Muslims are getting married. They're having, it's not angry you admire no, 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 I know you admire it, but what I'm trying to say is that you, you're thinking that with time, uh, ethnic people are growing and the white race is getting smaller and smaller, yes? Exactly, that's, yes. that's why we yeah. start working towards our own interests. Okay, so the majority of guys in, that you know that, that have this understanding, are they getting married? I, I don't... I've said the majority of white guys in America, are they out partying, sleeping with different girls? Yeah, that's yeah. part of the problem. <laughs> so what I'm trying to say, you're your problem. Yeah. You're not yeah, getting I married. Understand. Yeah. I agree with you there. Yeah. Okay, but so your problem is not with us. Your problem with your own people are party raving it's, it's a, it's and your It's not just one problem. It's many problems. No, but this part is a, of it is that. But, but this part is, of it is this is No, but I'm trying to say to you, you can't be one but minute. Damn, we, we get, wouldn't we're, die out if no, we didn't have them coming in anyway. No, so. but what I'm trying to say to you, what I'm trying to say to you, you can't be like, damn, we're gonna die out. Yeah, our race is gonna get smaller and the colours are, are getting more and more. Yeah, but yet you just keep on having one night stands and until it goes to have a bullshit. Yeah. So, the solution of the problem is to marry these women and not I, use yeah, them. I it's up to them to I it. personally believe the solution to your problems is God. <laughs> let them do that thing, let them Europe, <laughs> Europe has become godless. And that's why these yeah, things are, these, this is why these things are happening. You don't believe in God anymore. You've thrown God out of, you know. YOLO, like, YOLO. Um, it's decadence, you know, that's the what happened. That's way, brother. The and Roman way, exactly, the decadence. Of, of moral that's like the empire is falling yeah. and crumbling because yeah. liberalism, Trans nationalism, oh, nationalism, nationalism, nationalism is also. actually could replace it. No, it is not, because you know, you know why it's not? It is a because it was there already and it, it didn't work no, out. It can yeah. give people the strong, no. like I'm a nationalist and I've got strong I understand, but what, you know, you know, have you heard of Hegel? 
did Hegel dialectic. We know what he says about history. He says this, yeah? In history, usually a group of people have three turns until they get it right. So first time they go very extreme, which was nationalism. Then uh, 20th century, they go all liberal, okay? And then now what's gonna happen now is that you have to balance it out. There are some certain things in nationalism, um, and there are very few, that, that, that might help you, but the whole concept of nationalism was already here and it hasn't worked. It won't work oh, again. Sorry, sorry, and that's the problem that we. Worked? It won't work again it's because it's, 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 I'm ill, man. I'm Nigeria, Nigeria. It's like this. Look like, at East, you, you talk about godless. What you're talking about is basically what Eastern Europe has. Like they, they yeah. get married. They've got like yeah. traditional values. Russians, Russians, and yeah. they are all nationalists. They do not allow immigration. But look, Eastern European was also communist. Exactly. That, that's that's why communism. They are no, no, but. Whether no, they have that, it or not, communism was there. The idea of yeah, communism is not necessarily that. After they defeated but communism. In the 20th century, it was you were either capitalist, nationalist, or you were commun a communist. Do you understand? These are two different schools. My point is, and that's what I'm trying to say to you is, what is happening right now, this vacuum that whole of Europe is thinking, oh, populism, let's go, let's go national again. You know, it's not going to work. I, and I don't know how you're going to solve it. I mean, it's just it, a reaction. It's a reaction because that's a vacuum that has. I don't know how you're going to solve it as well. That liberalism has caused. You can't force people to be fathers. See, the whole thing with Islam. Well, I know there you are ways you can give financial incentives, and that's not no, working. But, uh, even. No, listen, listen, look, look. They're doing it in in, example, in, yeah? in, 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 um, in Sweden, and they, they've been trying to force people to have more babies. Incentives. It's not working. For example, it's, yeah, it's here. It's in here. Let me give you an example. They haven't actually been Let me give you an example. They haven't been doing that in Sweden. Yes, Google it right now. Let, oh, let me I'll give you. I, 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 I actually I read. Him. I read a lot. Let, let I read me give you an example. Yeah. In Islam, yeah. well, I try to read a lot. Anyway, so I'm never going to. The reason why you have such strong Islam. young families in Islam, you, in Islam yeah, Muslim. I guarantee yeah. you, <laughs> you will not. Become my brother. You're already my brother. You said you're from the Congo. Yes. Why have you adopted Islam? Europe, innit? I was in Europe, grew up around Muslims. What are your brothers in the Congo? What how they see? He doesn't give it to peer pressure. There, there's, there's, a, there's, a, there's a population of Muslims in Congo as well, historically. But do you know why I know you're not gonna, that, that, <laughs> that I would think it's going to be very hard for you to solve your problem, yeah? See Islam, yeah? As a convert to Islam, it solves so many different things. For example, as a Muslim, I don't listen to music, yeah? I don't have girlfriends, whatever that is, hang, girls that I hang around with and so forth, yeah? Like, it's segregation. So what I'm trying to say is that, you can't just force people to be fathers. It, it has to be yeah, something. You can do that. No, I tell, you, I, tell, I tell you why, I tell you why. Because when you you live in a country that's a secular, capitalist, atheistic country, and you pump into men's mind that a definition of a man is how many material things he's got, how big he is, how many girls he slept with and stuff like that, and that you only live once, there's no day of judgment, there's no palace, there's no cell fire. A man's definition of being a man with the lads Listen, is just... I agree with you. So, so what I'm trying to say to you, look, what I'm trying to say with you, with Islam, it has so many features yeah, that if you sleep, sleep around with girls and stuff in a community, you're looked down upon. If you have babies that are married, you're looked down upon. We don't listen, we don't watch all these music videos with women in beauty courts and the man got bare girls around them. So what I'm trying to say is that you can't force people to be fathers. And if the the if the brainwashing of being a man and sleeping around is more than a spiritual, how can I say, um, conviction. Conviction and um, no, I don't disagree with so you. So what I'm trying to say is how it's not Islam. So how, it's, no, it's possible to live like that. I'm saying with, just with knowledge about how the world. So works. why aren't your men doing that at the moment? Why is my because they've been led astray by by degenerate things in the media and stuff like that. And it, and, and and a capitalist, secularist, atheist society is, is winning, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm I saying call England is atheist country. Anyway. What what I mean is is that this whole YOLO thing. That's what I mean. You only live once, so get all the girls you can now. So what I'm trying to say to you is that, what is going to change it? Bro, it's, well, more, to, it's more than just, uh, I want to have a girlfriend. I know, but I'm asking it's a, you, bro, it's the, whole, it's the whole YOLO lifestyle, I'm saying, what yeah. is going to change it? Becoming know. aware, people, people, people like that, question, they, only think, they only think like five years in the future. But if you think like, say, 100 years or 500 years in the future, and then live your life, Sort of with that in your mind, that will leave you. It's sort of like living with a higher power, but it's more mm. it's similar to that. You know, you live your life in a different way. So you like you'll start. People just start like working out, and doing exercise. And, yeah. Also, the media is, is another problem. Like, did you Did you guys hear what happened to Toys R Us? Right. What? Toys R Us went bust, didn't it? And this, recently. Yeah, yeah. And the yeah, the, 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 the CEO, you know what he says? He blames the millennials. 
because phones. Because they had, they don't want to have children. They want to have a career first, and then they have children later. So another thing is, people put very money in the uh, economy, the GDP at the, as the center of their moral philosophy. And and, and achievement. That, if yeah. you put money at the center of everything, yeah. you should actually put, you know, human value, you know, human happiness in the center. Mm -hmm. Because the way it works now is that this people view the country as just merely economic units. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, that's like part of mass immigration. Like you have, say, people who work in a factory, and yeah. they have these people come over. What it means is that, well, these people could do your job for cheaper, for longer. Basically, yeah, it's viewing people as economic units. You know, you know, bro, I agree with a lot of stuff that you, you say, and also I, I fully see your perspective, you know? It took me a while, but like, it was a paradigm shift. You know what I did? I went on YouTube, uh, I was watching uh, jo Jordan Peterson, I was watching all these guys, I was watching even Tommy Robinson, and I was just listening to what they were saying. And if I was white, I understand your perspective. Do you understand? I understand your perspective. But it's not as simple as that. You, it's like you're looking at history just from like one angle. You, 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 you're missing up the whole entire angle and that's the problem that I'm you're in. I'm not even a massive fan of Tommy Robinson. No, no, I'm not just yeah, saying, I'm just saying, I, I train myself to understand your plight. It's very difficult, you know, it's very difficult for a human to understand how, how it feels to lose a leg when he's never lost a leg. Do you understand? So, the plight that you are facing is a very, very difficult plight because there's so many variables that you're not willing to accept. It's the, for example, the conversation we had earlier, on, you know, about colonization and about just being human as well and you know human interactions that happened in the past that you don't want to see as you know things like that you know and and I'm a, I'm a religious person and I also believe that you know certain things that you do uh, there are reactions to it so when certain things happen to a people sometimes it's because what the hand has sent forth so what is reoccurring to you right now might be might be to do with what happened before do you accept that? Do you hear what he's saying? That's my. I, I think I think you kind of agree. Well, in the sense of you said that the biggest problem with uh, enslaved people. Actually, actually do. Because yeah, because they come yeah. back to bite us. There yeah. you go. Okay. I actually do. That's that's why I say oh, it is. We both people have lost out. Yeah, I think that the, the the people of African descent have lost that much much more than the Europeans. Yeah. We're, we're well, it depends yeah. nowadays. You know. The course, they have the same quality of life as... Oh, as come well. on. No, it no, is, no, 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 no. There's still a lot of psychological... Do you want to add two cents into this? Do you no, think they still have the same life they had before, before, you, before you robbed the country? Right now, today, every African has a oh, sorry, smartphone, I was saying, has the same... You, do you want to add as, some The same quality of life as... How could you say, how could you say that we went and raped a country, yeah? And you pillaged it, and you were in the same position as you was before? Look, let me show you, you're wrong, I'll tell you why. I grew up in this country in school, yeah? Even psycholo psychology. That's another problem with. No, that's what I'm saying. It's I'm going to school. You're taught, you're taught as a white person who grows up in this country, you had the Greeks, the Roman, all the greatest philosophers, the scientists. I'm taught in class, my history, you was a slave and you were freed by Wilbur Wilberforce, whoever he was. Yes? Okay, if we're both in that class, yeah? My self, whose self esteem is going to be high? I understand. Higher? This is another problem of why. I don't want you just to understand. This is another problem of the whole situation. But, no, we're in. Okay, like, so what yeah, I'm trying to say to you, you can't say. And I, I'm not even in Africa. I'm, not, I'm in England. Yes? I'm not even in Africa. I'm in England. Yeah, and, this is another problem. It's affecting him. So what I'm trying exactly. to say to you. So and how has it affected you? Do you think it's that, you know, if you have Africans who think that, you know, have this sort of want of revenge, you know, they, they have this. It's listen, listen, sort of bro, they just want justice. What, 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 what revenge? So, let me explain it. What, what, what revenge are you talking about? Yeah, they, they understand. They get <laughs> He's told nervous about the revenge. I'm not, I'm not I, nervous. I'm not nervous. Like I'm saying, saying, I'm nervous just like you were saying, you get taught that you were slaves, and then you said you, you felt, well, I don't know if you felt angry. I'm assuming but you felt angry. I didn't feel angry. I'm saying. And then if you have people like that in the society. Explain what you're revenge. I wasn't angry. I wasn't angry. I'm saying to you, if we're if we're if we're both. It's like the argument, oh, we bombed them, so they bombed us. No, it's not that. No, it's not that. I'm in school. I I'm talking. You said that the people in Africa have the same. It's the same uh, same level before the robbery and the, the pillaging and the, and the conquering by the, the England and so forth. Yeah. I said no. It's it not. Wasn't, wasn't the Islamic slave trade about ten times bigger than the European? Yeah, that's a myth. That's a myth. Listen, listen, bigger. Listen, that's a myth. Go ahead for the fight exit. We're talking about England, yes? Well, like, you're saying 
that you got taught about European But it's not wrong safety. anyway, is it? It's not wrong, is it? Is it, the is it wrong? Safe it's wrong. Well, is it, it's known as the Arab, Arab slave trade. Well, listen, is it, is it wrong? You try to head for the no, fight exit. Let's go a bit. Look. I know that slavery still goes on to this day all around the world. It's bigger Britain, than was the the first, point you said Britain was the first to end slavery. slavery. The, yeah. the, 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 the point I'm trying to say no, to you. My point is, it still goes on to this day. Do you agree? Do you agree? You were saying that Africa, that they're in the same state before the... The, the, it was conquered, yes? You're saying the standard of living, you said the standard, standard of living. No, I'm saying Africans in the West. Yeah. You said the quality of In, in the West. So you have to clarify No, not in Africa, in the West, in, like the West. in this country. Nah, this well, uh, uh, how, many, how many black friends do you have? Not very many. Alright, so you haven't had a conversation about their... I their, have, yeah. And they've told you that my, my lifestyle is similar to yours, you said that, is it? Yeah. Well then, you're the partner, you can go and ask many black people. And I, he I lived in Croydon, it wasn't a nice area as well. Well, either or, I suspect if you ask many black people, they will not say they had the same life as you. There's 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 I suspect they might say the same. I think now you've changed it. You said in Africa. Now you're saying. In no, Europe, I said Afri no, I said Europe. Africans in Europe. The quality of life is a lot better than then, in Africa. Yeah, but they had empires before that were a lot nicer. Don't you think? But even if it was Africans in Europe, it's still. We're talking about psychological. Can I ask you a question, yeah? Who was the richest man that ever lived? It's a guy from Mali, apparently. But oh, like, black this is guy. besides the point. He was a black guy. You understand? Know he, as a race realist, none of this, it, he really is, is, is white first. Yeah. <laughs> yeah? And, and maintaining well, white. I'm happy you the answer to that. Yeah, so, so, so trying to try to hit like a moral compass from, from my history of talking to a race realist, it's not gonna it's not gonna happen. Yeah you know I mean so that, that's the reality. What I say, and this before I move on, it's very important that we talk to people like this because this is this is a better conversation to have rather than people who, who keep it in and don't tell us how they really yeah, feel. Yeah, cool. Now people like him get in power and they put policies forward. Yeah, yeah and that's, that's that, that, that well that's, it's best to know how yeah. people feel so you can try to have a, a counter now. I'm all for that. But, but yeah, all well, I would say to you is, is that I understand people yourself. like me are the future. Like I'm I'm sixteen. <laughs> like you know how many people my age, like agree completely. I agree, yeah. I see no, I'm I, telling you, yeah, the time yeah, is coming. Yeah, but this yeah. is like, but let me warn you right now. But this is the first one. Let him speak. Let him speak. Let him speak. He's warning. He's not human for you. He's listening. What he says is more valuable. Guys, I'm listening. Yeah, I wanted to say this because he's warning about something. I'm not listening to you. I'm young. I came onto this scene already divided. Right. I know. You and you're going to the Harvards, you and you're going to the Oxfords, and you're going to, you're in, in the future, you're going to set policy to keep our asses in check. Probably. I'm, you say I don't you've know got what you mean. No, no, I'm saying, you're saying that you've got... <laughs> he said that confidently. So what you're you know saying what? to... So the you're letting us know. The time is going to come, mate, I'm telling you. The, yeah. the time will come. Yeah. Yeah. If it's not, people like See? me... See? Let him talk, let him talk, let him talk. I'm not let him talk, I'm not stopping him, I'm not stopping him. Let him say the same thing, the time will come to him. When the tables will turn, right, it's not going to be good. Now, who? Okay, Here's what it is. There's going to be people. major conflict. Right, let's say come Ramadan, right? Yeah. And all these bombs start going off. And what are you talking about? Let him, let him happens, please. right? Which is going to happen. And then say there's riots in the streets from the white community. And then what happens? Like, say, say it gets bad. Like, but that's not a solution. I, 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 I don't know works. where bombs went off in Ramadan. Revolutions never work. Where do bombs go off in Ramadan? You need to I'm know. I'm not this. talking about revolution. I'm talking about civil. It's good. There's going to be civil war is a revolution. Stuff. Listen, listen. Yeah. yeah, just remember you're a minority. That, <laughs> that, <laughs> when, when another one. You see that train of thought. You know that train of thought that you 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 pantering. It's exactly. That's what Tommy Robbins says. That's what Tommy Robbins says. You know what Tommy Robbins? No, no, no. He's talking about reality. He's got no, no, brother, brother. He's saying it from his perspective as a realist, and that's. To, to, as the brother said, that's the kind of stuff. But the tone has changed. You know what's yeah. going on. You, got, you, you, you can't come with an emotional. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 You gotta have to listen. Yeah, yeah. And then from yeah. that listen, above you, the you, belt, you above the belt. Yeah, come on. Ding ding. You see what you're saying there? It's not gonna help your situation. Yeah. Ever. I'm warning you, man. Like, there's nothing, you hear there's nothing to warn. There's nothing to warn. In England, you have 1.2 children. Why is that to warn? In 200 years. This, we exactly. How are you going to do this? Somalis alone are going to outbreed you, bro. Forget exactly. 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 This is the exact problem. Yeah. Yeah. No, but you're saying too. You know what's sad, yeah? You seem like such a nice guy, and we was having such a a nourishment and beneficial. We were learning of each other stuff like that. And then you come out with, and I know, like Raven said, it's good to let you speak because you can't let these people speak because you don't want them to go underground and then go to Oxford and Cambridge and all this stuff and then become Prime Minister, I understand that. But then your tone changed, it was like, and it's not going to be nice, when the bombs start going off in Ramadan, and the whites don't like it and stuff like that, it's not going to be good what for do you. you think what, gonna happen but next? is that a solution? Well, I'm not worried, Jackie. I'm not worried. Is that a solution? I don't, look, you know, remember the Parsons Green orange. bomb? Yeah. My friends were on that train. That's one stop away from my school. That? I know, I understand, but like, 
it's all the threat is always there. Like that's that was, was you know my ancestors were in Africa. You went over but, there like, the and you robbed is, it. Yeah, it usually you, they remember, start you know my ancestors were in Africa like, and you went over there and you robbed them and yeah, you raped them. No matter what person's green in Africa, no matter what you tell him, so person's green. Let's put it He's a he's a white person first, so he will never see. I've spoke to many and they will never see that. But it's okay. We're okay. Let's look at the reality of the situation. I understand. I understand. Yeah. No, he's thinking. Let's look at the situation. We're gonna slip Cambridge. We can slip into. No. Listen. We're gonna get into the Conservative Party. Listen. Before you start bombing things and destroying things, you have to build. Build yourself. It's not me. Know yourself. Love yourself. Look at the situation we're in right now. What is the situation? Last Ramadan, there was what? How many? There was about twelve attacks, right? Where? Where? In London, around London and Manchester. In London. Where is London? Why are you surprised by this guy's fear for the bomb? This is London. In London. I there was you, he was you, watching Fox News. I don't no, think the West, was, no, but there was an attack on the Muslim saying, guy. The, there was an attack right at the mosque. The one yeah. attack. But you see, this one trying to say, like, let's face reality. You know, at the same time, they were like, there's going to be a point where there's going to yeah, be a but, stronger but, reaction to some of these. Attacks. I understand, but then but prior, you know prior, prior, prior to that, there were three attacks yeah, by no, Muslims. Uh, London Bridge he's saying, he's and uh, what was London Bridge? The other one, Westminster Bridge. You know, usually. Is this good? It, I understand, but like, you know who usually yeah. around Ramadan. What do you understand? Why do you not say what I said to you just now? The point. What point I, was I actually sure. trying to make to you? You didn't listen. You see? I, I'm not sure what you meant. Okay, the point I'm trying to make to you is this, yeah. Whatever you, your, the prophecy that you made here, okay, is not a glorious prophecy. It's a, it's a, a prophecy of defeatism. Do you understand? The white race is not going to win that way. Well, you have to do because you understand no, the problem. That's not what I'm saying. Look at, okay. Let's look at the reality of the situation we're in. Yeah. Okay. There's already like starting to get these movements like with Tommy Robinson. That's mm. already happening. So mm. it's usually around Ramadan is when the attacks start picking up. Like there's there's about a dozen last year. There's going to be a time when there's going to be a lot in, in one Ramadan, and but then you know the and then there's going to be a strong. People are going to start you know the rising huge on problem the streets, with this. You and know, then it will be. You know a, the big problem with this analogy. Most of us, most I understand of, you because they all uh, look no, at the no, past no, injustices. It's not, it's not you know the this majority reality people, of the situation. Yeah. The majority of people in London, we grow up in how can I say working class, middle class things. Asians, Africans. Uh, can I just say? Can I, can I just can I just finish it? Uh, Asians, all of Africa, this is besides no, the no, point. No, no, what I'm trying to say to you. You know Oxford but, Street. No, no, how many times no, in Oxford Street is there a false alarm? No, yeah, well, everyone's listen, in a panic. You, you're, you're understanding oh, where your problem. Like, you know where you, that, that you know where you're We live here, bro. The we live here. What I'm trying to say to you is, you know where you this, this analogy is not going to work because most people, yeah, in this country, Africans. Asians, Jamaicans, Indians, yeah, even Polish, Algerians, Moroccans, we live by, by next to each other, yeah. We borrow sugar from each other. We take each other's kids to school. So do you know what? When you put all this terrorism crap on TV, no one buys it apart from no one buys it apart from the white people that don't mix with the ethnics. So the whole thing is is that. So so the reality is the reality of the situation is that most ethnic people mix with Muslims, so they don't buy this crap about most Muslims are terrorists. So yeah, you might have some white. It's people. not about most Muslims. Excuse me. The reality is, well, there's going to be a bunch I'm of telling attacks. You, go Tutin, go Elin, go Ed. Fair enough. Why don't you say the, the majority of ethnic people who are not Muslim do not believe that Muslims are terrorists. It's only white Fair people enough. that watch BBC, ITV, Channel 4 that don't mix with That ethics. may be true, but it is true. That it will come to Ramadan, next Ramadan will come. Let's, let's, be so let's take away his saying. Listen, bro, you, what you're saying, yeah, because you said, because you, you included yourself in it, you said, I'm the future. I'm giving you advice here. What you've done, you've done the first step, and it's an amaz amazing step. You surrounded for now. You were surrounded, and you were a minority here, yeah. And you were still yeah. voicing your opinion. You were standing for what you believe in, yeah. What I'm trying to say is, it's a dialogue and it's a discussion. That's what we have to have, okay. And then what you, what you do is, from whatever you've learned today, you go back to your people and you tell what you have to do, Get married. okay. One That's of them, exactly. exactly. But this prophecy. That, what? No, it's, it's not. This is. Look at the. Where is it? It is a prophecy where, because where, you're saying right, it's going to happen. Say? Listen, whatever. Right, here's the thing. People are getting. Yeah. Quite, like, people, everyone has a smartphone, everyone has a TV. Like, yeah. Is it getting easier to do the basic necessities of life? Yeah. Like, buy a house mm -hmm. or start a family or yeah. get married? Well, do, yeah. do you think yeah. it's getting easier to it's do that? Harder. Yeah. And Pete, there is this. It's going to reach a point where maybe there'll be in some sort of economic collapse or major attack or major social. No, 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 that's Tommy Robinson there, bro. He no, talks I, about not. it. Tommy Robinson always, there's a brink, the words can class, they're going to go crazy, they're not going to take this I'm anymore. Not, I'm not Stop. really a fan of Tommy Robinson. No, no, but you no, that's, you, you, you're exactly doing that, that's what you're doing. You, you're you pandering. Talks, though, I'm just talking about it, yeah? You've heard this talk today, yeah? Yeah. So it affects you, you know it affects you, even if you're not, like, you're not intending to that's listen to it. That's not where I got it from. Uh, no, I don't think, I, this, he's a race realist, so. Wait, the race war? 
Do you want to race more? No. Do you, do you believe that immigrants are taking the jobs of people in this country? That's not why I believe what I believe. But no, about, yeah, about, yeah, yeah, I do though, yeah. Hold on, you're, I'm I'm, listen, I'm telling you. No, yeah. what? This is not a fact. Would you, I work in security, I've been to many different buildings, yeah? The cleaners in that place, yeah? Are not English people or black people that work that live What's in this your country. Point? I'm so saying, saying that okay, we're not capable most of doing. I never said that. Like, I'm so saying, you're saying that they okay, okay, would. Most immigrants. Up. I Listen, here's, this okay. is why I don't agree with you because in, we've only had immigration for the last 50 years. Before then, there were everyone did the job. There was no problem with people. The market. If someone doesn't want to be a cleaner, the wages will go up, and then more people will want to be. A cleaner. Anyway, anyway, here's a question. That, you, know you, that, that, up, the, the, you know, you know, you said that a competition between two races, yeah. What? That, i.e., the whites always win and dominate. I never said that. You said that earlier. I mean, did I? Yes, you did. What did I say? Especially in the US and America. I said you? we took America, yeah. Okay, fine, you took America, but generally the, uh, it's, a, it's a kind of, kind of a, a superior race. I never uh, said... But you had some insecurity that the population growth is, you know... To, to well, uh, yeah. And, and, and it would be kind of like deteriorate to, to the not as, as smart. I don't know, you may have to look at it. But what if, if this whole kind of multiracial population becomes to, a, like, growth at, a, at the, the growth is at, at the speed that's going to take over your kind of... Or bloodline Euro are going to be. Are you going to take an action? Are you going to take a like a decisive action, no. like a genocide, or like? No, this is part of the action I'm taking. Come out and speaking about it. Like, but yeah. I'm not so, so what's going to happen? I mean, the, the growth rate within Muslims and other race, races, there's multi-racial uh, marriages happening all over the place. In two, three hundred years, everyone's going to be mixed. You're this is be, exactly. You, you say that because you're, you're obviously. You're, are you European? Where are you from? No, I'm, I'm from Middle East. And you can say, oh, you're all going to be mixed. Europeans yeah, aren't going to exist think, anymore. But look at it from my perspective. When you say that, then you're saying, well, then why shouldn't I want to fight to preserve my own people? How are you going to fight? That's my question. So why shouldn't you could choose to have If you're saying that we're going to be mixed out, why shouldn't why shouldn't I fight to preserve? How are you going to fight? That's my problem. That, that's my question. Because I'm, I'm, I think you by can speaking either, about it. You can speak about it. But, but, but answer my question. Why shouldn't I? If, if we're going to be bred out anyway, like you said, then why shouldn't I? You, you have the right to. So why are you but, but complaining? It's, if inter it's interesting that. So do you expect that, people, the people to just that sit represent down and the nation, it? such as the Queen, you know, her daughter in law is black, oh. and, and generally speaking, most of the world. We've been over to, it. That baby's we, not We just be went over that. Yeah, that, so, so I think there's going to be another car crash. So the, the point is, the, 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 the world is moving toward like a multicultural. Is it? Yeah. 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 The world is going to be mixed. I don't actually think it is. But you're going to be a minority. I don't you believe the world's going to be This is exactly what I'm fighting against. It's going to be about 5 billion Asians and 4 billion Africans. When you say that, you're just making me war. You're just confirming what I'm saying. No, no, it's not true. The world is not going to be mixed. The reality that we face in We're not getting more mixed. We're actually getting more nationalists. Like, look at recently, like. I'm talking about race, I'm not talking about geographical nationalities. No, people are, more and more people, especially young people, are agreeing with me. Like, I'm, well, I'm young myself. Like Cabo, I think, so, uh, you're talking about I think that's a French group I just, of white, hold on, young hold on a second, people. hold on a second. I asked you earlier if you see a really attractive black <laughs> girl or like a colour. We went over this. Man. And you said what? Said, no, I said that I want not. my family to look like me. Listen, no, my, my point is, it's not. It's but, about blood. Right. Just be really it's not about country. No, my point. He's is a bro. he's a race race, really, so he's he his paradigm no, no, no. is white first. So he's the growing point up is with that. It's not about geography. It's yeah. about bloodline. Yeah, but that's that's his paradigm. Now here's the question, right? What is the biggest challenge your bloodline faces, and what is the solution you put forward? Yeah, that's more, that's that more question, of a constructive yeah. conversation. Yeah, that's more constructive. I want to hear this. Solution. solution no, no. So what? what's the first challenge that your bloodline... Yeah. Your, 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 no, you warned us. Get, getting solution. rid of the guilt for their own history is so, the first step. Okay, so so, so <laughs> how, how do you do that? How do you do well, people are guilty of like colonisation, slavery, and being people, themselves. The white people, white people, people in general. Yeah, right? yeah, people shouldn't be guilty. That's the first step. <laughs> I'm, I'm not a politician, like, mm. I, all I believe is that different groups exist and everyone has the right to advocate for the interests of their own group. Like, I've grown up as a minority in London, I don't want my children to be a minority <laughs> in their own city, like, in their own school, and yeah, at the end of the day... Yeah, a Muslim, isn't it? What's going on? But you know, the, you know, even in London, white people are not a minority, right? You know that. What? Black people they're, 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 they're more, they're more white people in London. The more white people 40%. in London. 40% of where? London. Is oh, right. London. Not London, maybe, yeah, but nationally, not, not the UK. nationally But like also, I'm American, simple. right? And in a few decades... How do you feel about you the know, whites yeah. that went to you America? Know, and then, this is what I'm saying. My, yeah. 
looking to the future. Okay, then say that. Do you regret the way? Because you grew up. Because you said you grew up. Michigan or Massachusetts? Massachusetts, yeah. Yeah, that's why you're late. But I've actually, wait, Massachusetts is one of the. How do you feel about Americans taking over? What do you think about the white Europeans that went to America and um, killed a lot of uh, Indians and the Aboriginals? I don't think anything of it. You have no emotional regret. I'm proud of it. I'm proud of it. just told you you want to get rid of the guilt. Well, where are you from? This is what I'm from. I'm half British, half British. So, what do you think of when the Ottoman Empire slaughtered many Europeans? That's wrong. I'm not. I'm anti-war. I'm not yeah, for shedding blood because you're superior. But people you suggested who went earlier. went out to America. They did. They, they went out. You, with su- the, you said earlier, and I asked you clearly. If this whole population growth of blacks in the U.S. You said if uh, they, the, the majority become black, it, it will become like Africa. Did you not say that? I, I think that different people did you create not say societies yes in no? their own image. I didn't okay. say that. No. You said I it will become not, like Africa. I said Sorry, that. No, become like I never said anything would become like Africa. I said oh, that. Fine. Now you change your. No, I said sense. different people create societies in their own image. Which right? means. Which Europeans means, create European societies. And like black Africans will... create African societies. Like. Oh, okay. Are you disagreeing with that? Right. So do you so think. The, so the colored people of the US are on uh, well, if you, similar uh, kind of social and political understanding as the black Africans in Africa? No, no, no. But it's cool anyway. You've let us know that well, you're going to get yourself into a position. Where you can, um, you know, control things so that you, your race or ethnicity doesn't die out, and that we, you've let us know that we've got to be prepared. I, all, all I'm saying no, is, no, like, what I'm saying is, yeah, this is sorry. the future. You see how terrorist attacks are increasing all the time. Oh, trouble, like, it's the, you may like it or not, but at some point there's going to be a strong listen, reaction to it. Listen, do, you want, like, do, you want give, do you want me to give you some strategy and advice? If, what is this when you're coming out? You're making oppositions of many different people groups. So you're, you're highlighting black people, Asians, um, and Muslims, and so forth. That's not me. It's everyone. No, no, I'm not saying it's right or wrong. But what I'm saying is, I'm saying give yourself a tangible start, right? So you've identified that maybe the birth rates within the white community is low. So I would say start start there. Maybe try to um, have like an app that that, that that allows Europeans to find other Europeans. That's you, what think, I do. Yeah. Well, you try to make an app. <laughs> no, like I do. That's what I focus on. Yeah. I don't, that that would be a better starting point, right? I try to deal with those tangible important. challenges that you identify. The fight, as in you got, you got low birth rates and that concerns you. But when you start, if you're going to talk about other people groups like Africans, Asians, and so forth, it's best you do the research because you, yeah, you talk yeah, about you Haiti, you, you talk about Mali, you talk about Egypt, and you yeah. got it completely wrong. Yeah. But I understand you don't care anyway, so it doesn't yeah. matter. Right? I'm saying before you talk about other people groups, I'm not going to talk about Europe's history and get it wrong, am I? If I said that um, uh, uh, Germany well, is, is in Peru, you go, that's not right. Because you're correct, right? So I'm yeah. saying, if you go to other people's uh, uh, culture, let's get it right because the conversation going to go on. Because what you were doing is, is we're making all these um, arguments to strengthen your worldview. Do yeah. you understand? It was strengthening your worldview. And, and, when, when, deeper, deeper, deeper. and when you when you use all these like mistaken these mistakes to strengthen your worldview, you have defects in it. Do yeah. you understand? It undermines your argument. It yeah. undermines your argument heavily. So what I'm trying to again, I'm saying it as as a, as, a, as, a, as, a, as, a, as a human and as a brother in humanity. I, you're my brother. You my brother in humanity. Exact same thing. No matter what the history was, I still believe. That exactly. Yeah, but then you're your idealist. And those terrorist attacks, they're wrong in Kuwait, Saudi Arabia. But it's not but Oh no, I'm, I'm, I'm saying this wrong. Yeah, right. It's wrong according to Islam, but that's nothing compared to those mad white guys that are shooting up all the kids in the school. If you compare the terrorist attacks in America compared to those crazy guys, that's so, yeah. you agree. You may be wrong or right. It's not, you agree, it's not in comparison, ain't it? So don't worry about the start skin terrorists, yeah? You, listen, it's not whether I have to worry about it. The reality, you may be right or wrong, but the reality of the situation, right? Let's say with all the stuff that's going on now, with all these, yeah. let's say there's another, say like last year, there was a, what, like three in one week or like a few in a month. Let's say that happens. Three in two months. You, yeah, let's say that happens again, but worse. Yeah. There is going to be a stronger reaction. Say people start the rioting. I'm trying to say, like, so I'm not sure if you become, if you become, if you uh, get And get then yourself, people will start taking sides. If you get yourself in a position of power. Would you want that to happen? I don't necessarily want it to happen. I think it's inevitable. Bro, if you put, get yourself in a position of power, like politics, let's say you become the leader of the, the country, what, what would you do? No, He's 16 years old. No, 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 no. He's the I'm not a politician. No, but what would you do if you had power? <sighs> No, do what, 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 do what have I been of, talking about? What do you think about? of Adolf Hitler? What's your God, I don't want to talk about that right now. But you did say you support KKK earlier. That was a joke because you oh, said, do you joke. support the KKK? It's cool. I said yes. Anyway, it's fine. Are you serious? No. I don't support the KKK. 
We support the concept. Uh, to be honest, no, that's just something you projected onto me. I, I need to take nothing. This guy. Yeah. I asked you the question and you said yes. Do you support? Do you support Obama? Do you support Osama bin Laden? No. Why would you? Why should I? Well, that's like what you're asking no. me. I answered it, but I, I, think, don't, for, I don't joke around. For, with for me, I think what it is is there's a, there's a guy who's saying things that people are not used to hearing. Yeah. But it, there's a value there, and if he he has a genuine concern now, how you got that concern is interesting because that needs to be studied. But he has a concern, he's pushing it forward. Yeah. I would say never tie your emotions to ideas. Yeah. Mm. Hear what people have to say, and then yeah, keep it stepping. Do you know what I mean? That's what it is. That's what I can say really. But anyway, it was nice talking to you. Yeah. Easy. Peace. All right, easy. I'm going to go. Man, say it straight. Man, don't listen to BBC. Man, don't listen to. Why do you think that people throughout warm lands took this It was hygienic reasons. It was just easier to take care of the hygienic. Otherwise, 